So today is today. I leave to go to training. Like I said in the previous episode, the college chapter is closed. The new chapter is beginning now. So I have to win a national championship. Um, the following weekend, we had the parade. And once again, Michigan fan base showed out. Something I had never experienced before. Even though I have been to parades with the Bruins, Red Sox, and Patriots all being teams that have won championships back in Mass. The difference was when you go to a professional sport parade, they have barricades where fans can't cross a line. And our fans were literally like on our buses with us. like. In that moment, we were on top of the world. Like, we just won a national championship. We have the whole city of Ann Arbor, the whole University of Michigan behind us. Like, you know, what, what, what better feeling than that? I'll tell you what's a better feeling than that. I got a daughter on the way. We're in our second trimester right now. Things are going very well. Um, the baby's growing at a, at a very good rate. Um, my girlfriend, she's super happy. I'm super happy. We're just learning different things as the days go. It's all a part of the process. We're trusting in God, knowing that he's gonna help us come that ninth month. You know, she's gonna deliver a healthy baby. You know, that's what we're praying for. When we got here, you know, we kind of mentioned that we're taking a break from our dogs back in Michigan. Uh, one day we ended up walking into this, you know, this puppy place. I walked in, I saw, you know, a few different puppies, but there was one that caught my eye. I walked by him. So, you know, looked at a, a few other puppies, walked right back, and I was like, man, I gotta get this dog. It's a lilac and tan Frenchie, um, you know, for my dog lovers out there. Like, when you see a, a blue-eyed lilac Frenchie, you almost can't, like, just walk by it and not, like, think about, like, I wish I had that dog. And so, you know, I told my girlfriend, I asked her, I said, Babe, like, what do you think about bringing this dog home? She said, don't ask me, you know I'm gonna say yes. And, you know, it was all said and done after that. So, went home with a new Frenchie, named him Zero. Um, I think it goes a part of my identity, you know, wearing number zero, Frozone. He's gonna be a good one, I like him a lot. Why every morning you come in and you decide to troll, bro? What are you talking about? He not running today, that's why. I don't know why he gave me all this food. I did not ask him. Uh-oh. He gave me an O-line play. So I'm coming in to Exos. I think this is definitely the, the best situation I could have stepped into. The people at this facility, uh, I think, are some of the, the most down-to-earth people, most genuine people that I've met. The speed training is phenomenal. Um, I think everybody that's going through you know, Coach Calloway's training right now is going to run a very good time at the combine. The position work, you know, we're grinding right now. A few of us are with Ja'Cory one way. He's putting us through that ring right now, and I know that come combine time, everyone's gonna be sharpening them drills. Coach Rock, 
great guy, you know, building a relationship with him. I see the work that he puts in. I see the mindset. I see the way he handles his business day in, day out. Um, the things he says to us, the tips, the advice he gives us. He wants to see everybody do good. Like the strength coaches, they've been helping us in there. We've been, you know, going hard in the weight room. Everybody's numbers keep going up week to week. And I know that, you know, when guys go out there for that 225, the big guys, the skill guys, the big skill, everybody's going to, you know, put some good numbers up. So I'm excited to see that. And lastly, but not least, the physical therapy is top tier. You know, you go in there, you do your recovery. And for me, that's been one of the most important things, staying on top, staying ahead, being proactive, not reactive. And, you know, as I'm going in daily, I'm learning different things about myself, what I need, what's going to help me. Um, you know, what my deficiencies are, my imbalances, and just, you know, make sure I'm taking care of all of those things just so I can stay sharp. When you're warming up, go ahead and get in the stand. If I'm not timing, I'm going to stand over here let you guys do your thing, all right? It'll we'll take a couple of minutes, let you guys go through some run throughs. Everybody feels good, a little timing. Everybody's got two, two and two only. So here's a psychological component. I always say, I always say uh, discipline and or uh, some level of critique without information is nothing more than abuse. Make sense? No. So I'm gonna give you the information behind why we're doing two and why I'm, why I'm going to tell you no if you have a bad rep. You've gotta get accustomed to knowing I've got one shot to hit this right, and that's it. Go, 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 go! Keep showing up, keep showing up. We got better, we have better time. Better time. If you want extra work, let me know. We can always come back out here and able to make sure you do you should, bro. Oh, shit. You should have been here. You should have been here. I have time now. I have time now. Here we go. Everybody get him in the chat. Hey, family on three. One, two, three. Let me. Fuck, my touch is was off. Shit. Come back, work on it later, though. Hey, why, why is today the first time you say we get extra work? <laughs> oh, bro, we've been here since January. I was going to say today the first time. Come back and get extra work if you need it. The way I feel right now physically, um, I feel like I'm in a very good spot. I'm doing the, the necessary things to take care of my body, take care of my mental um, with, you know, proper nutrition, proper sleep, proper recovery, like ice bath, massages, eye cryo, you know, red light therapy, you know, doing the things that I know is going to help benefit me. This upcoming class, uh, the guys I'm working out with right now, each and every single day I feel like it's just a brotherhood that's forming more and more. Uh, everybody's happy for the next man. Everybody wants to see the man next to him do good. And we all have one mindset of being great and, you know, cashing in on, on, on payday.
We sweating today. We sweating today. But uh, my dogs used to say, sweat equity. So understand that too, where like, I can go flip, get back in my pedal, put pressure right there, flip again, now I'm ready to be. Yeah, I like that. I like that. You going setting up, still gaining, and then go. You know what I'm saying? Miles, he in that bitch just pop. going on young goats it's frozone and today i'm gonna walk you through driving out of brakes so the first thing that you want to make sure is that you have a rhythm step coming out of your brakes so if i'm breaking 45 to my right my first step is going to be on my right foot and then it's going to be my left i want to be able to get that foot down as quick as possible and generate good force when i come out of that break pay attention that my chin is tucked to my chest but i'm not looking down and this is so that i could take two steps to the man so I could drive out, and then I want to find the ball. All right here, you see it right, left, chin tuck, two steps. Then I look up to locate the ball. Same thing going the left way, left step rhythm, right step break, left foot get it right back in the ground, generate force, two steps to the man, come out. Now when I'm in my side run, it's three steps. So left, right, left. I'm gonna open my my left hip. I'm gonna snap the right one. Put that left foot right back in the ground and come out. Right, left, right. Go in the opposite direction. Get that right foot back right in the ground. Snap that left hip. And this is nothing that you have to do at full speed. Just walk through these steps to give yourself that rhythm and just feel out each and every rep that you take. Getting the muscle memory of what these breaks feel like. Really trying to focus on getting the steps down in the ground right now. Keeping that chin tucked. Not getting your eyes up right now. Generating that force. GG's. Bars up! Bars up! Go! Alright, here we go! Five reps, no! Yo, this ten, ain't it? This, this ten! Go! Go! Oh, wait a second, come on! Uh oh! Overhead. Oh, press the top. Keep your hips in there. That's good work. Hey, 
Strap on three. One, two, three. Strap. Strap. It's time to do what we do best. We in the best place to do it. With the best type of you know people to do it with. So it's time to ball out now. Shoot, he'll tell you. They'll tell you. Time to ball out. We just out here grinding, dog. Moving. Trying to get paid, dog. Just like any other man out here. The one on the left, yeah. we will have it wider. So you'll come out, you'll touch, and then you'll touch back at an angle. An angle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that way, when, when you, you hit, hit that turn, you ain't you're already like. You are the angle to hit it. Yeah. yeah. So the only way you can help yourself this money, to do it the coach hurt way don't is know. if you start closer to the inside cone. Yeah. So that way, when you touch, you angle out at the outside cone. Yeah. Great day at work. Hey, Dom, I got something to tell you, bro. Uh, 385. 5105. Yeah, I just. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah. So they used to play like the map? <laughs> yeah. yeah. For sure, so let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. Bet. Good day at work. Good. You know what I'm saying? Wake up. Dog, first thing. Come here and get breakfast. Straight into working out. Yeah, you see the perspective of everybody. Big dogs. You know what I'm saying? Skill position, running back, linebacker, big skiller. Everybody in this facility is chasing money. Everybody's trying to get to it. We come in here, we push each other to be better, push each other to be great. Because, like I said yesterday, like at the end of the day, we all chasing the same dream. Um, and the only way we could, we could get there is by competing with each other. And then, you know, having that competition with yourself. Um, yeah, man, today, great day at work. Just PR'd on some uh, on some new drills. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let the numbers talk come come by day, but I'm definitely feeling good right now in a good spot. Right now we in the tubs getting some recovery. I always recover. You gonna get out of your body once you put into your body. So if you're eating right, sleeping right, recovering the right way, and you gonna get the best results. And right here you see it. We doing recovery, man. So when your goals become the new standards, the only direction is up. We up now. We up now. Next up. Came about that bottom, earned my stripes, became a stepper. Had to raise the bar, now the bar exceeds your effort. I ain't come up with a silver spoon.